Hey everyone, I'm Hannah and today I'm going to talk about the history of my personal style. Don't worry, it's not that long. I'm not even three decades old. <laughs> but we will have to go back in time a little bit. I was the kind of kid that had an innate love for dressing up. Like I had to change my outfit no less than three times a day, which was a nightmare for my mom who had to do the laundry. <laughs> I would say some things haven't really changed. I loved wearing floral and polka dots and both of them together at the same time. But then there are other things like stirrup pants, which I will never wear again in my entire life, if I can help it. Then as a teen, I did the usual teen thing, you know, oversized t-shirts, baggy jeans. I was plus size, and I know that a lot of bigger girls, they wear oversized clothes to cover up because they're not comfortable. But honestly, I love being fat. And I just wore oversized clothes as a fashion choice. <laughs> Maybe not a good one. <laughs> but I really looked up to my older brother, Ethan, who you guys know. He was big in the BMX scene and Avril Lavigne was basically a style icon to me and she's the ultimate skater girl. So then in my late teens and early 20s, I finally started to explore other styles and I did that by using thrift stores. I had been thrifting my entire life, but it was only then that I really started to explore personal style and I realized that thrift stores could benefit me because I could try out literally any style. So that's what I did. <laughs> I was really drawn to vintage and because I was plus size, it was a lot easier to source because a lot of secondhand clothes were coming from older generations. So the clothes were just more old-fashioned and more modest, which actually worked in my favor because I'm a very modest dresser. I mean, even nowadays, I am completely buttoned up. So yeah, now here in my mid to late 20s, I am 29, I'm really focused on clothes that make me happy and that make me feel good. I describe my style as being colorful with an edge, but even more than that, I want to be a very conscious thrifter that's mindful of what I'm bringing into my closet because that in turn will help me create a more versatile wardrobe. Less confusion, more clarity. I want to get dressed really easily, but I still want to look unique and have fun. And that pretty much sums up my style story. <laughs> I'm going to be sharing more throwback pictures and random facts on my blog, theoutfitrepeater.com. So be sure to head over there and check that out. The link is in the description box. Thank you so much for joining me today. If you like the content that I'm creating online, then be sure to support it by liking and following and subscribing and commenting and sharing it with your friends and all that good stuff. Hopefully I will see you around on the internet and in the meantime, be excellent to each other.